How old is your control system? When did you install it? 10 years ago? 15 years ago? Maybe 20 years or more? You might be finding that it's uh, more, becoming more difficult to maintain. Maybe parts are becoming more difficult to find. So because of this, you might be considering an upgrade to that system. Well, I'm Kent Morrissey, and I'm with ABB. In this video, we're going to talk about a few things to consider to help you lower your cost and reduce the risk when upgrading your control system. The first thing to look at is the I.O. terminations. In any kind of an upgrade strategy, that's the last thing that you want to touch. Relanding terminations can be very costly and time consuming. So any upgrade strategy, you'll want to look at maintaining your existing I.O. terminations. The second thing you might want to consider is your control logic. You've developed that control logic over a number of years. There's probably been several modifications that you made along the way. The last thing you want to do is think about changing that control logic or having to translate it or reprogram it. That would add a lot of cost and risk into any upgrade project. So what you want to look for is the ability to reuse that existing control logic as is. There are systems out there that will allow you to take a new controller with new technology and to simply load that same configuration that you've used over many years into that controller. The third thing you might want to consider is the operator interface. And some of the things you might want to look at are first off, the operator graphics. You'll want to make sure that those operator graphics are converted so as to minimize any impact to operations. The second thing is that you'll want to make sure that that operator interface contains the same level of system diagnostics and maintenance displays that you've always had within your control system over the years. And the third thing that you'll want to consider is to make sure that that operator interface is integrated in with your system so that it doesn't feel like it's a separate bolt-on package, but instead an integrated software product that's easy for you to use and maintain. There are really three things that you ought to consider when upgrading your control system. First off, for terminations. Make sure that the terminations remain in place because to do anything else would be very time consuming and costly. Second thing is your control logic. Make sure that you can find a control system that will allow you to reuse that logic as is. To reprogram it or translate it is risky and can also be very costly. And finally, the third thing is find an operator interface that integrates very tightly with that system so that you don't lose any system diagnostics or maintenance displays that allow you to use that system effectively. I'm Kent Morrissey and I'm with ABB.